it's summer. And that means ice cream. So today I'm going to show you how to draw an ice cream. Let's go into the drawing part. So as mentioned, today we're going to draw an ice cream. And it's really important to get the top right. So I'm going to be very careful when I draw it in. So we'll start up here, drawing an S shape and then close off the top with a C shape like this. Now, these lines are just going to be my guides because I'm going to draw in some more details. Afterwards, I'm going to make a ellipse. It's going to be the next layer. This, and the third one. So now I have my guide for the top of the ice cream and now I'm going to fill in some details. I'm going to start here. Just try to follow the shape of the top into the point here, into the top point. And another one here. And into the point here, T as well. Now I also want to have one here, but this one is going to be a little out of the shape, just like this. Because when you pull down soft ice, you will often see that it's going to twist in a lot of different ways. Now on in the second layer, I'm also going to do something similar and I will think about the shape as being like a piece of pasta here yeah. and a S shape of a mirror this shape like this and now one here. This is going to be leaning. This down to the same point here, and here as well. Just thinking about these swirls, have to kind of follow the shape of the ellipse. Another one here, and down like this. And the same process is going to be applied to the third layer. Now that I have these details colored in, I'm actually going to give some more depth to the ice cream here. Yes. This is going to be a huge shape up here. Curving up here. As you can see, there's a lot of guides, a lot of lines that I'm not going to use later on. But you can see that when I finished off, I'm actually going to trace it out with a black pen, like this. Okay, so the next thing is going to draw under this top part, which is soft ice. I will go and draw some balls in, and I'll start in the middle. Yeah. And I just imagine that I have a whole circle. Like this. And from the bottom parts, I'm going to draw a wave like this. Now I'm going to draw another ball right here. And the same thing with a wave. It's just going to be right behind it here. Just like that. Now, I'm going to make a point that's going to guide me. I'm going to do it right in the middle here. This is going to be the cone and I'm starting out by doing a guide as well. Oh, well, that was not too good. Another one. Like this. 
it's important to look at this point when you start up here look at this point where you're going to end the line just like that okay so the next thing i'm going to do is draw some small u shapes smiley shapes here all the way down i'm trying to make these shapes equally long and in between I'm going to draw some triangles like this. now I like the old cones that is actually waffles that is twisted and they look like this so on the other side I'm going to do the same yeah. Okay, another thing that I'm going to do now is drawing in some... Uh, you know the, the cone is going to be a round shape. So in order to make the waffle pattern, I'm going to guide myself again. Yes, curve shapes, triangle to triangle. This. And here, behind, I'm going to make the curve opposite, just like this. Now I'm going to paint and draw in the pattern, which is just going to be some squares. So now I'm done with the cone. and. I'm going to draw in a spoon because you cannot eat an ice cream like this without a spoon. I'm doing like this. Very simple spoon shape. And the hole here. And then make it three dimensional. Oh, why not put in a cherry? I'm going to do it like this. J and a C okay, this one from here. Yes, C and I have a leaf. Hmm. Why not put in some waffle pipes as well? I'm going to do that. Okay, so that is going to be really simple. Straight line, lips straight line at little angle, I don't want them to be completely parallel. Another one here, a bit shorter, same thing. And they're going to have a swirly shape of here. Now, this is basically the ice cream. The next step is going to be tracing it all out with a black pen, but I'm going to speed up that process. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, make sure to hit the thumbs up button right below the video here and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this.